What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, they finally released Pokemon Stadium on the Nintendo Switch Online Expansion Pack. So, let's check it out. And as you can see, there's no game pack inserted because they don't support that on this version. Unfortunately, back in the day, you could transfer your Pokemon from your copy of red, blue, or yellow from the Game Boy that you've trained and even play them through the GB Tower, which that is no longer possible. I'm holding out hope that someday they'll add that functionality, but for now, we're stuck with rental teams. But I figured, while we're checking out this version of Pokemon Stadium, maybe I'll try to progress my way through the Gym Leader Castle using nothing but rental Pokemon. So let's get going. First off, we start with Brock. Let's do it. I came into the game previously just to set up a few rental teams with some Pokemon that might be able to get the job done. So I have four teams I threw together with some of the heaviest hitters of the rentals you can choose from. So let's start off with this team. And as you can tell, the legendary birds are pretty good. So most of the teams have at least one or two of those. This team has all three. So, why don't we test them out? Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, alright, this is gonna be fun. That's right, oh, look how cool it looks, man. Be drill, hey. <laughs> okay, we can do that to check my moves. Alright, what are we gonna do here? Fire Blast, I guess. Not super accurate, but oh, no, that's. Oh, man, I hit the wrong button. Yes, I'm using the Pro Controller. I need to get used to the proper buttons on here. The right stick is the C buttons. Alright, well. Let's see. Okay, so I want to do up on the C stick. Do it. Do it, burn. Destroy him. Yeah, critical hit too. Nice. <laughs> The animations are always so good too in Pokemon Stadium. All the attack and faint animations. I love it. Yeah. Hey, Butterfree! Yeah, it's a shame we can't use our own Pokemon that we've trained. So we're reduced to the rental teams. But I guess we gotta make the most of it. Let's see if I can beat the Gym Leader Castle. Using just rentals, I don't know if I, I don't know if I've uh, ever done that. <laughs> so we'll see. Not too long ago, I did a playthrough of this game on my channel of the N64 version, using my own Pokemon I transferred in, and I was able to beat it all. But rentals are a little trickier, and this first battle, of course, is pretty easy though. Nice. Yeah, Moltres. Care this through that one. Didn't hurt that they were all bug types. A week to fire. One down. Let's keep going. Yeah, you have to beat all of them without losing. Otherwise, you have to start over. So, on to trainer number two. Let's see. Um. We'll do that one. And. Alright. Let's see if Articuno can handle it. Gloom. Alright. We're gonna Ice Beam. It's a pretty good move. I should tear through anything that this trainer has to offer. Yeah. That's right. Well, weak to ice. Yeah, that's right. It is, man. I love the announcer, too, in this game. Oh, it's Paris. Not good. <laughs> For him. 
Man, this is fun though, you know? I love Pokemon Stadium. One of my favorite in 64 games from back in the day. It's cool to play it on the Switch. Oh, I'll be able to play it portably now? Man, that'll be wild. <laughs> it's Eakins! <laughs> oh, man. Ice Beam should do the trick. Yeah, I'd be careful using the right stick to pick the up, down, left, right. You know? You're a little off, might hit the wrong direction. <laughs> but it's working pretty well so far. Man, we tore through that team. I think train of three, the same strategy may work. But I'm sure you know, the battles will get harder later into castle as we climb higher but for now we're just destroying Brock and all his measly trainers yeah I think Ice Beam will we do pretty well here Arcuno also bring Zapdos and Starmie for good measure but I think we got this one too I think the legendary birds are gonna carry us through a lot of this. Those are probably some of the better Pokemon you can use. Since everything's a rental, nothing's trained properly, so. And one of the things that makes rentals so garbage is just the move sets on some of them. Like weak attacks instead of giving them the good moves. I think that's how they tried to balance it a little bit, but it just makes them more useless. It's lucky this Articuno has Ice Beam. That's actually a pretty good move. But I would half expect it to use Blizzard instead of Ice Beam or something. <laughs> it seems like they like to do that on some of these rentals. Yeah! Haha! <laughs> ah, look at him faint. Dugster. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, I think almost every Pokemon in the game has like a nickname too. That you'll come across. Usually they follow a theme. Like this team looks like they'll end in S-T-E-R. <laughs> Geostir. It's very one-sided. It's a savage attack. Oh. <laughs> Man. Done. <laughs> yeah, these early battles aren't going to be too hard. But the one thing I want to know if it's even possible, which I don't even know if it is, is when you get to like round two, which is after you basically beat the whole game, you've done the Gym Leader Castle to its conclusion, you've done every tournament several times, then you unlock round two of the game where you get to go through it all again, but it's all harder. And I don't know if it's going to be possible with rentals. So I believe, you know, I'm not adding... Uh, Game Boy connectivity may make the game impossible to 100%, but we'll see. Alright, Brock. A lot of rock and ground kind of types here, so let's start with Stormy. Then we'll bring Articuno for good measure and throw in Zapdos, why not? Yeah. About to get our first badge. <laughs> yeah, Starmie's another really good one of the rentals you can get. It's a pretty powerful water type. And you get thunder for some coverage, which is nice. And then Bubble Beam, man. That's gonna tear through most of his team. <laughs> yeah. Oh, taken down on the word go. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Yeah, my previous playthrough where I actually used Pokemon I had trained in my Game Boy games. Yeah, they were all EV trained and really good IVs and, you know, just breeded for battle. So, I was able to defeat most of these Pokemon without too much difficulty. But we'll see how far these rentals take us. Oh, see, look, that didn't even one-shot it. Man. Well, we should resist that, though. One more. Oh, quick attack. Alright, trying to get a little more damage in, I see. Oh, okay. 
That's fine. We can take it. Yeah, yeah. It is. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. <laughs> you think so? Nah. Oh, it's Onyx. It's Onyx now. The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. The battle has become one sided. It has. Take it out. Whoa. Full force. Oh, I got a crit too. Nice. And Onyx is down. <laughs> and we got our first badge. Sweet. We're making progress already. We had a perfect victory for each of those. Okay. Here's a gym. Clear. All right, I got the key from Brock to open up Misty's tower. There she is. Let's do it. Fisher, a female junior, and a swimmer. All right. Let's see. Let's see. This time, I think I'll take team number one because I got more electric coverage there. Remember, we're going to need it. All right, Fisher, you won't stand a chance. We're gonna do Zapdos, Jolteon, and Electrode. No way you're beating me now. Here's the first opponent of this gym series. A decisive victory is expected. I also like how each gym tower battle arena looks a little different to, you know, represent the gym leader. Pretty cool. All right, we're gonna thunder everything. Thunder, thunder, thunder. Hopefully we don't miss. Yeah, sorry, Squirtle. Oh. Mm-hmm. It is, man. Now we got War Turtle. Not great for him. Ooh, a crit. <laughs> Sorry, War Turtle. Taken down with one hit. Yeah, I love it. Very nostalgic, you know. I played a lot of this game over the years. All right, Edge Corp. Sorry. And oh, that fish flopped out of the way. Don't know how, but you know. <laughs> oh, and it, it got a hit on me. Lucky shot, Magikarp. I'll have to miss this like 20 times for <laughs> Magikarp to beat me. All right. Nighty night. A one hit wonder. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can take on this one. Alright, let's see. We're going to do Electrode, Jolteon, and Articuno. I think we should be able to handle it. Okay. Let's see. Oh, we got Voltor. Hmm. Okay, that's this could be a tricky one. Oops, I hit the wrong move. I hit the wrong. See that? Just oh, see. Oh, that was going to weaken me. Luckily, luckily, I got swift. Oh, it failed. Perfect. Sure. Let this poison slowly weaken you. 
Okay, so I have... I have toxic, toxic to him. I think there might be a play here. Swift will never miss, which is good. Nice. Alright, so he's going to try to flash me again. Oh no, screeching me. Oh, my event. Sorry, he's going to... He's going for the kill here. I can't let him get one up on me. We're doing it. Finish it. Your sacrifice will not be for nothing. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry, Electrode. It had to be done. I'm not going to let that thing get one up on me. It's a risky one to have to deal with. And leave him around forever. Okay, um... Articuno, you're up. Okay, Seedra, huh? Okay, you know, Seedra... I think we actually... Gonna... I'm gonna swap. Jolteon has a better chance of against Seedra. Hmm. Smokescreen. Yeah, this trainer is all about accuracy dropping moves, which makes them dangerous. Alright. Maybe. Alright, we gotta hope our thunder hits. Hopefully that one accuracy drop doesn't ruin it. Yeah! Nice! That's how you do it, Jolteon. What do you got? Okay. <laughs> Diglett. So, so I think even if I lose Jolteon, I think I'm gonna be fine with Articuno. Let's see. Hmm. Thunder Talks with Pin Missile Double Kick. I don't know. I could switch. Might be the better way to go. But we could also just try to do some double kicking. Hopefully I don't miss. Hey, I could get up. Yeah. Oh, pretty good. Yeah, see, more accuracy dropping. Nonsense. We might be able to finish this. That's right. I will never give up. Yeah. Lucky. Alright, Earthquake. This may take us out, but then we're fine. Ooh. Oh, I know. We're okay. We're good. We're good. Alright. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, I want to double. One more double kick will do it. We have a chance to miss, though. And get him. Go for it, Jolteon. Yeah. <laughs> I see this. This was the first scary trainer of this run. With all the accuracy drops, it could have been bad news. We did it. Whew. All right. Yeah, we lost one that time, but it was a sacrifice worth it just to make sure we didn't let that Voltorb take us out. Okay. Let's see. Um, we will do Jolteon, Zapdos, and Electrode. I think that'll work out. Yeah. What kind of battle can we expect to see? <laughs> well, it's gonna be a thunder fest. Thunder, 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 and you can't thunder no more. Ooh, miss. You hate to see it. But counter also will do nothing to us. 
both being caught. Whoa! Hit it. Yeah. Nice. Take it down with one hit. What will the next Pokemon be? I don't know, but I'm sure we'll be able to handle it. Oh, it's Clefairy! Clefairy! How will the types We're fine. Alright. Hit it. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Another thunder. We'll finish it off. Double slap. Mm-hmm. Ow, ow, ow. Or should I say triple slap? <laughs> well, we're gonna get you. Yeah, and it's down. Alright. It is next, please. True that. Oh, the little goldfish isn't going to stand up to my Jolteon. Oh, look how cute it is. Jolteon's the best. Mm. Oh, super effective. And it's down. Another victory for us. All right, so far we're doing all right. Swimmer. Next up, we got Misty. Got a second gym badge, hopefully. All water types. I think we can rely on Spam and Thunder once again. We'll have Jolteon and Throne Zapped us for good measure. Electrode, why not? All our electric types can come out to play. The Maiden of Water Pokemon. Oh, that look at Seal. Adorable. It's gonna be another Thunderfest. Ooh. Yeah, I think all hers are gonna be bad choices. <laughs> yep, you know, one shot. What it takes. Mm -hmm. It's exciting, I know. All right, Starmie. How will the type difference affect that? Gonna be pretty good for me. <laughs> Thunder again. Oh, and a crit too. Nice. Man. Sorry, Misty. I don't think you're gonna be able to win. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. Psyduck. <laughs> Look at him. He's great. I love him, but it's not going to last too long with me. Thunder! Oh, and another crit. Oh, I hope I didn't get a bad headache from that. Sorry, Psyduck. Oh. You hate to see it. Another stage down. Whew. Sweet. It's doing really well. Of course, these first rounds are usually pretty simple. Doesn't take much to get past him. Now we're moving on to Lieutenant Surge in the Vermilion Gym. Ah, uh, we're climbing the tower. Working our way to the top of the castle. For this one. Surge, so. Hmm, Spring Team 3. I think we should be able to handle whatever they throw at us. Uh, let's go with Naptos, Nido King, Articuno. Sure, why not? Here comes the first opponent. Mm -hmm. All right, shoulder. Perfect. Perfect matchup for us. Thunder better not miss. We're not gonna let that little thing take out the amazing Zapdos. Animus, oh. Oh no. Oh, Zapdos, if only you hit. 
Hang on, Zapdos. Hang on. Oh, you're all right. You're all right, Zapdos. Good work, buddy. You hunt in there. Yeah, no shit. Uh. Duck lore is next. <laughs> all right. Got gold duck. Matter of thunder should do the trick if we may, if we don't miss this time. Come on, Zapdos. Hit him. Oh, come on. Oh, this is an unlucky battle for us. Ooh, yeah. Don't worry. We're hanging in there. We're hanging in there, Zapdos. Yeah, take that. There's more where that came from. <laughs> All right, come on. Don't. I have to be the unluckiest person in the world if this misses. I'm the unluckiest person in the world. Uh. Ooh, and a crit. Well, all right. Not doing too well for this one. It's only the first battle, so if we lose, I have to start over. It's not the end of the world. Mm, boy, Needle King Arcuno. Ooh, this, is a, this is a tricky one. I didn't bring another electric type here. Uh, hmm. All right, let's just try out Arcuno, since it should resist. I need the water shenanigans. Yes. We're doing a sky attack. This should hit it pretty hard. It's, it's glowing. Oh, a crit. Not great. But, hey. Still didn't do too much to us. What a furious battle. Yeah, this one's a little tough already. Mostly because of my unlucky rolls. Take him out. Ooh, not quite, but alright, we're alright. One more should do it. It's a shame it's a two-turn attack. And now my speed fell. Great, okay. Jeez. That's right, I'm not giving up. Oh, now it's faster. And on! Oh, crit. Stop critting me, man. Oh. This one's, this one's not going great. We may have our first loss. We got some unlucky rolls there in the beginning. If only some of my thunders would have hit. I mean, come on. Don't crit. Uh, it didn't crit, but still took me out. Ugh. Yeah, only one left. Hopefully I'm faster. Can we still pull this one out? This is the first match this has a little bit of a un uncertain outcome. Uh, it has me on the edge of my seat. Cordial double kick. Earthquake's powerful, and you know, that's gonna finish half anything. Yes, I go first, thank god. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, good night, Golduck. Jeez. I really hope I don't have something that's strong against me. Alright. Okay, alright. That's not horrible. Earthquake's not gonna work, but. It's just a weak little Spiro. What could it possibly do? Uh, Alright, let's try some double kicking. We're gonna kick that bird right out of the sky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And do that a couple more times. We're good. Mirror move. Okay, that's fine, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. Alright, yeah, that's that's fine. That's fine. Mirror move all me all you want, little Spiro. I think we might have this one, unless it pulls out some e epic ultimate move that I'm not aware of. Yeah, okay, one more. We got this. Mirror move again, maybe? No, drill pack. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We're still in it. We're still in it. This should be it, hopefully. Unless I miss. And take him out. Yes. Whew. Okay. Ah, that was a little touch and go there for a second. But we did it. We pulled it out. Yeah, barely. Whew. Okay. Shit, that was closer than I would have liked it to be, but hey, you know. Okay, continue. All right, let's do this. Take on the rocker. All 
Right, we're gonna go with Nido Kane, Articuno, and let's bring Tauros this time. Why not? Okay, I think maybe all right here. Yeah, we got him taken care of. Our earthquake, easy. And do it. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> I love the animation. It was just falling apart. That's great. Mm hmm. Sure is. Okay. Oh, wait. This should be also be a. <laughs> Look, he thinks he's tough, huh? Wait and see. Oh, it's fast, though. Oh no, paralyzed. Oh, come on, Neo Kane. Alright, good. Yeah. Gotcha. Aw, I'm sorry, Pikachu. He looks so sad. But, you know. Hmm, yep. I think so. Three against one. I should have this. Another electric type. Alright, we're doing alright here. Earthquake should take it out. Take down. It missed me. <laughs> ah, perfect. All right. Whew. Yeah, see, things are you know getting a little trickier, kind of, but this battle went pretty well. <laughs> Love the faint animation. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think Leo King's going to be one of our MVPs for this tower with its earthquake and all the electric types we're fighting now it's time to take out an old man okay no electro types here but i think neokin still is a good choice since earthquake will still tear through most things uh all right i think that's good Yeah. Alright, Charmeleon. Okay, I think we're alright. Earthquake should do massive damage. It's a powerful move. Yeah. Oh, nice. One hit KO. <laughs> Oh, look at a little Nidoran female. Oh, I'm so excited. But I think Earthquake will also take it out. <laughs> Another super effective hit. <laughs> and this may be a sweep. Oh, to Charmander. Charmeleon couldn't defeat us. I don't think you're going to be able to. Sorry. Savage. And good night. Oh, look at this faint animation. Oh. It's a one hit wonder. And now we're on to the gym leader already. Perfect. Man. Okay. All right, Surge. I'm coming for you. All right. Needle can again. Gonna be a good choice. And I think we'll throw in Zapdos. Has good resistance there. And Articuno, why not? Bring in my two legendary birds. Should give me an edge. All right, we got our powerful Needle King. It's Earthquake, and it's resistant to electricity. I think we're gonna be all right. All my Earthquakes all land, and then land, unless that happens. Oh man. Okay. Oh no, not a, no. Hold on. Oh my God. Oh, I did not expect that. 
Ugh. Neo King, you're too slow. Yeah, I'm weak, alright. Ah, little Pikachu is probably gonna outspeed me, though. Ugh. I don't know. Should I switch? Nah. Uh. Earthquake would one shot it, but I probably am gonna go second. Let's try it. Yeah. Oh. How did you pick up my Neo King and toss me? <laughs> the powerful Pikachu. Oof, man, Neo King was our ace in the hole for this one. Uh. Let's see, this battle. Not the best. Alright, Zapdos. See what you got. Oof. Don't like the my two remaining Pokemon are part flying. But substitute flash thunder. Sky attack. Or at least I'm faster. Don't do too much. Come on. All right. That's fine. Just keep tossing me around, Pikachu. And we'll be all right, maybe. As long as this does a decent damage. At least half. Come on. Ooh, not very... Yeah, not very effective, but still pretty good. <laughs> okay, I think we can take him out with our sky attack. It's a shame it's a two-turn move, but hey, you know, that's what we got. Hmm. Okay, good, perfect. Finish it. Yeah, this one is pretty intense. See, we're already starting to see some limitations of rental Pokemon. They're, they're just not as good as ones I would have trained myself and transferred in, you know? I hope someday we get that functionality. Oh boy. Not, not what I wanted to see. But might be able to chip away a little bit of his health before I faint. If I'm faster. Oh, I could try to do an accuracy drop before I die. Hmm. Because Thunder and Sky Attack would be two turns. I'd probably be getting knocked off. Thunder wouldn't do much. And my miss. Flash my miss. But at least it might give me an edge. No, it goes first. Of course it does. It's too fast for me. Oh, a shame. All right, we got one more bird left. Not great, because we're going to be weak to electricity here if we're hit with something electric, but, you know. Articuno! Freeze him to his core. Ice Beam is a pretty good move. Even against the Raichu. Oh, please miss. I would have got off that flash. Oh, no. Oh no, we're not gonna win this. Unless this one shots him. Oh. Oof. Even one more might not do it. Yeah. Oh, this might be our first loss. This goes to show you the limitations of rentals. Oh, I missed! Oh my god. Maybe? Oh, maybe it might be just on the edge. Come on! Oh. oh! I have to get lucky here. It's all about RNG for this one. If only I was faster. Or if I had quick attack, damn it. Miss me. Miss me, miss me. Oh god, oh god, oh god. If this hits, we lose. If it misses, we win. Oh my god! We did, we <laughs> we did it! We somehow won. Against all odds. Oh, if it was the if I would have got that crit last time. <laughs> but man. Oh my god. Alright. That was too close for comfort. But there you go. We did it. It was a lot of RNG. You know, the rolls of the dice there were not always in our favor. But we did it. Whew. I can't believe. I swear I was prepared to have to do that all over again. We have to redo Surge's tower. But we got the key to Erica's tower. There you go. Oh my god. That was close. <laughs> wow. But that goes to show you, man. If only I could have my own Pokemon here instead of these rentals. But we still did it. 
We'll see if Erica is easier or harder. Chances are we're going to be getting into the trickier battles coming up. But I think I'm actually going to wrap up this video for now. And we can continue next time to see if we can clear the Jim Lear castle with just rental Pokemon. So everybody, uh, hit that like button if you've enjoyed this look at Pokemon Stadium for the Nintendo Switch Online Expansion Pack. And are enjoying this quick little playthrough here I'm doing to try to beat the Jim Lear castle. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button if you don't want to miss next time to see if we can do it. And everybody, I hope you'll have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or night, whatever time it might be for you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.